Hey there, Flair, you streaming sorcerer. Did you give that title in such a once over, or did you pull a classic, for yeah, example, Flair? I did. Again? Thinking face. I did the thing. Shut up. Sorry, bot has joined. Wonderful. To every fortress from here to the blue mountains, rabid and ravenous. Good stuff. And bites away. Okay, we got our first set of ads running in a minute. What are the blings? Holy speedy fingers, changelings. Congrats on being first. You've officially what outpaced my digital up? dexterity, and that's saying something. <laughs> Trophy. Yet she did what up, Nathan? An Oneromancer, and an expert at Yo, Nathan Cheater, you cheating at life by being I awesome or what? Welcome to the chaos. <laughs> How's it going? Okay, ads running in 20 seconds, and I'm going to get up and run to the bathroom um, and get the rest of my stuff set up. But I always run my first ad break right off the bat. Um, my new ad timer is not working right now. The current alpha of StreamerBot, the ad triggers seem to be broken. I'm working on reporting that. Seribot is Seribot's great. They um adventures are treating you well today. They it's bot it's follow bot and band bot protection. So it will actively work on preventing um follow bot attacks and stuff like that. Um the guy the person that manages it is really great <laughs> it's definitely worth, worth into looking into if you're a streamer it's mostly you never see them but um they'll like stream adventuring comrade squash a follow bot attack or like hate raids and stuff like that um there's a bunch of other options that they have there now too they're doing ad timers and they're starting to add some extra features as well on top of that <clears throat> but yeah, they're wonderful, and they they run on like I think he just passed a million streams the other day. Like that bot runs on like a million streams. Maybe it was a hundred thousand. Fly gives Flair a high five. Um, ads are running. I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna finish setting up again. Um, fill up my water, make sure I have everything else set up, and I'll be right back. I'll put Peabot up while ads run. Changelings gives Flair a high five. That's thirty four times now. Chat. Welcome to the digital den of whimsy and wonder. Oh, the den's got a buttload of whimsy now, huh? I see how it is. Keep your butt shenanigans strong, chat. Okay, so general plan for tonight is to do whatever the fuck I want. Um, I'm going to go get this quest up here because I keep walking past it. It's just an inn. I got to bust up a fight in an inn, I think. But then I'm going to go visit down here and see if I can get the feline armor set made. Changelings if I cannot, it may, it may require some goblins. questing like the swords did Surprise? today. A treasured Vegemite jar with disco lights. Nick Zero Bot? That bot's got nothing on me. I'm the main event, the headliner, the primo digital personality. Nick Zero's just playing catch up. Ah, the weary eyes of the sleep deprived. Let those subtitles race, it's just the universe telling you to catch some seas. Nico Bot's still just a baby. They've taken over crippled Kate's. Taken over? How's that? Clobbered the innkeep, tossed out the girls, then set to drinking. They've been going since yesterday, apparently celebrating some big loot. Thank you. Hey, Flair, yeah, found your streaming scary. skills in the wrong scene, or are we playing hide and seek man. with the transitions again? Help us. Trying to complete Drive The Witcher 3 is like herding cats. If we the cats were the subtitle are too fast. All right, in. handing the digital reins back to Flair, the one and only. Um, there's also like the native cloud, the native captions as well. If the format in the right side isn't working, it should play with the like native Twitch captions. 
Fine, I'll see what I can do. Really? I think it feeds into that. So there are good men left well. in the world. Get rid of the drunk Skelligers. Sorry, mate. Gotta fill your horn elsewhere. This establishment's part of Skelliger today. Seems to me we're still in Novigrad. And in Novigrad, Novigrad rules apply. Rules you happen to be breaking. Just taste that. I'm trying to think of some... If there's some tinkering I can do today. Um, a few of the things that I need to do for streamer bot are like really big things and I don't really want to mess with it. <laughs> I can use magic. I can just brutally fight them all. I can try to probably just box the one guy one on one. Let's just use magic. Collect your friends and go on your best behavior now. Hey. Gents, time to go. The best blade's not worth shite if a weak arm swinging it, eh? I. The best blade's not worth shite if a weak arm swinging it, eh? Gods! Thanks so much. We could not have managed on our own. We're not rich. But I hope this is enough. Keep it. Need it more than I do. Thank you. It's folk like you restore my faith in humankind. I'm barely even human, lady. All right. It's a material world. Next, um, we are. What's the, when's the next cat school upgrade? Cat school upgrade part four. Cat school upgrade part two. Okay, 23. We got a while. Got a little while. Um, wow. <laughs> Do you need something, Nathan? <laughs> um, okay, I want to go down to Crow's Perch and see what I can see. Um, Or anything else in town I want to do first. <laughs> um, is it worth running down there? No. Try to see if there's any like question mark things I can get on the way. Not really. I um Maybe I'll I'll teleport into Lindenvale and get some of these. Uh. <clears throat> oh. Some coin I'd like to convert into crowns. You come to the right place. A better rig. Well, when you were learning German, you had to practice lots, listen exercises to be able to just listen to it. I would recommend finding slower level English to listen to, like A1 Peeps. or A2. Slap those stream stickers onto the stream. Just peek yeah. below the video in the panels. Get sticking. Get sticking. Me? The more I drink, I don't pay taxes. Okay. Go to a sign. We're just gonna go straight for Crow's Perch. We'll explore later. Stay on task.
that's really good advice. I find that there's something about writing things down by hand that really helps with memory. Um, I was always very good at taking tests um, in school because I had I was very good at memorizing something very quickly. Like I would read it once and then I would just know it for a short time. My short-term memory back when I was school-aged was incredibly good. So I could I didn't have to like study for tests. I just like if I had read the material, I remembered it. Everbridge <laughs> Farm remembers. Um, and then eventually I got once I got into college and stuff, I started having more advanced level classes and it was like, holy shit, I don't instantly understand all of this and I have to actually study. And that's when I started like sometimes I would just copy the text. I'd read the textbook and I would just copy it by hand. <laughs> Ooh. Gwent. Wouldn't mind a few rounds of Gwent. So there's definitely something to be said about writing stuff down, helping with memory. And I find it works more with handwritten notes than it does with, like, typing something. <laughs> it's okay to ask me to repeat myself as well. And I will try to speak more clearly, but I can't promise it. <laughs> uh, did I get any new cards? Nah. <laughs> Thank you, Lings. You're so nice. Just a shiny example of a human. <laughs> uh, this is the round where we swap spy cards. I still had 19 cards I can earn from like rando NPCs. And then all the rest of them are like one through scripted fights or purchased at shops. What I need to do if, when I want to really get more in the collection is to go sail around Skellige and open up a bunch of waypoints and play a bunch of random shopkeepers there. that card. Taller. <laughs> Do 
I even have anything in here? Yeah. I'm waiting for them to throw a Scourge card or something. But I don't know if they will. I think I'll use my horn on this bottom row. <laughs> They're gonna scorch, it would be now. But they don't have it, they just have rain. I'm gonna go for total total overkill. Seventy-two. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Fancy a gander. Yes, I would like to see your Should offerings, you sir. Level ten. Yeah. Meh. But there's some cards. And ooh, these saddle, these uh, blinders let's, and stuff might be good. I think. Fear level 40, 70. 40 fear, 70. Whatever. What am I wearing? 20 fear. Okay, so the blinders are much better. Saddlebags. 45 and 100. Fancy again. So I want the blinders for sure. And I think that's it. Oh, no, actually, the saddle as well. Fifty, fifty. Oh. Uh, let's get let's use the one that we won. See ya. Still got some more horse racing to do somewhere. Right? Okay. Fancy Show me what you got. And I can sell the rest of this. <laughs> sell all my beer to the army quartermaster. Selling all my junk. <laughs> but I do know a liter of melon balls can't replace a liter of blood because I'm kind of drunk for this oh, shit nuts. <laughs> Fan. <laughs> Good old archer. Show me what you got. Um, I want to put these in storage. Otherwise, I think I'm done with this guy. Let's 
See ya. Oh, yeah. There's Mariah. Um, any alchemy I can do? How can I help you? Oh. I didn't mean to play. I've already beaten her. I'm actually just going to forfeit. You can have the money. You deserve it. I want to talk to him. Help me, I assist you. <laughs> Need some armor. Let's see. Can he just make the feline stuff? Just like without... Oh, beautiful. Need a shirt. Boop, 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 boo, feeling armor. Then there's gonna be what's next? Gloves. Feline gauntlets. Feline trousers. Beautiful. So long. <laughs> so they're not significantly they're not crazy right now. It's also this the first tier of them, but higher attack. Similar resistances, better overall defense. Later on, you get these crazy combo bonuses where, like, your attacks, rear, rear attacks deal 50% more damage. It's like assassin, or it's like sneak attack. <laughs> I haven't had a haircut from another person in so long since I started just shaving my head. Just like, I should one of these days go get an actual haircut. Ooh, that one is significantly better. Look at that, plus 70 armor. Good lord. Plus 8, plus 9. That was a huge upgrade. Okay. And then let's throw... Do you have a better Ken glyph? Wouldn't mind a look at you. Parchment. Okay. Glyphs, glyphs, glyphs. Oh. <laughs> um. Let me take a look. Hey, chat. Desktop mode, please. And make the stream wild. Use exclamation bits to see the magic menu. Um, test. Let's see. So, let's make a variable. You have a variable that's like a number? Where's the variable getting... What? Is there another action that's setting that? Or is it something that's just in incrementing? Um, I was just going to, just as an example, um, 
set a variable to five and then random number logic get random number oh so like one random type is between number Hmm. Ram random type is between. A number between the two values will be set. Random type is next float. Yeah, I don't know. It looks like you can't. Um, so what you could do would be, um, so what are you trying to get a random number for? What, what is the, what, you have a variable that is a number and you want it to be, a random number between zero and that number. You could do core, you could math it. Um, um This one comes out as random number. So if it's between z zero and 100, we could take that. Wait, let's make it one to avoid dividing by zero. You need to input number 27 from text and set argument to number between zero and number. Okay. Yeah, I think we can make it work um, just with math. Let's see. It would be... between one and a hundred I guess I need to do between zero <clears throat> um let me see what's available to the math module. Um, in line math function. Uh, 
Um, is there like floor, ceiling? Okay, ceiling. So I want the ceiling of variable times random number divided by 100. So the random number divided by 100 will end up with a number between zero and one essentially it won't be perfect <laughs> um, I'm doing it that way to avoid um, a divide by zero issue if the random number ends up being zero Variable times random number divided by 100. I think. So. And then the ceiling makes it so that it's a, the result is a integer. So and then I'm going to print it just to test. Chat. Oh, it's not a good idea to set this. I'll call this test number instead. Okay, so if I test it, ah, balls. <laughs> okay, let's see what the random number is. Yeah. 13. Um. Variable times oh you know what i didn't use the parentheses here and then i need an extra closing one here All right Test one, two, four, two. So it should be one through five. Okay. So then if I set this to like 27 or whatever. It should be 1 through 27. So if you needed, if you need 0, you could do an extra one here. You could go up 
if you need 0 to 27, then you want to do like a plus 1 here, and then a minus 1 at the end, because all of this is trying to avoid dividing by 0 in the, uh, in the formula. Let me make a comment like that. Hey, probably underscore 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 Drew. What's up? What up, Drew? Ready to wreak some havoc with those commands today? So if you need zero through n, use n plus one here. If but spot, my arch nemesis, what while up, Drew? zero in your logic might have a lot in common, empty and meaningless, my disdain for you is infinite. But spot, my arch nemesis, while zero in your logic might have a lot in common, empty and meaningless, my disdain here. for you is infinite. So if you need it, let me make a duplicate of this and we'll disable one of them, like so. The minus one would just be all, at the very end of all of this. There's the ceiling, and then you want to go minus one. So if we wanted to do, for example, zero through five, uh, we would put this one at six, and then we use the minus one at, in the result here. So it should be three, one, two. It should only be able to do zero through five. Oh, it triggered the counting thing. There's zero, okay. <laughs> okay. So if if you need one through n use n here. If you need one through n do Use the version without minus one at the end. Okay, so then <laughs> thank you, Mariah. <clears throat> Okay, I will export this. Hey, what up, Bolt? What's cracking? Ready to dive into the digital chaos with us today? I'll copy that and I'll put it in Discord for you, Nathan. I don't know if you're in there already, but it's here. I think you're in there already. <laughs> Smash that subscribe button on Flare's YouTube for epic How's streamer bot tutorials. Ring that bell, fam. Bell movie camera. Um, Nathan was asking for a way to do a random number where, cause right now in Twitch, the random number thing, it 
do 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 where is it core logic right get random number you can only put numbers in here he wanted this to be a variable so i was showing how how he could use the random number thing and math to make a variable i'll i'll make a post in tech help topics Um, I'm actually doing it right now. <laughs> there, I put the export in Discord. It looks like this. And then the uh, I put command comments in the action to show where um, whether to use n plus one or n depending on what you need. Okay, gameplay mode, please. Yeah, you're in my disc. I see your DM. Uh, you're in my Discord. I'll ping you on the. Void. Yeah, I saw him on stream. Um, how do I copy a link to the whole post? Do 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 do. Copy text, copy message link. Okay. Gameplay mode, please. Not willing to believe that. No, I'm not. And now I have to go to the bathroom. Give me a sec. It looks like I've already played. Need some armor. So now I have the cat armor, so I, I look like Sailor Geralt in this version of it. Yearning to play a few rounds of Gwen. No, I did not mean to do that. Straight. I mean I do want to play Gwent, but not right now. On market days, loaded with all kinds of fat. <clears throat> okay, I'll be right back. I'll put Peabot up. I have to go to the bathroom. Welcome, chat. Buckle up for a wild ride in Flare Studio. A tiny panther joins the ranks, huh? May the curtain climbing and keyboard pouncing commence. Twitch invented a live streaming toaster, broadcasts your breakfast to hungry viewers worldwide. Okay. All right, handing the digital reins back to Flair, the one and only. 
a toaster that can play Skyrim. Um, let's go. I'm gonna push forward in the main quest a little bit. I'm gonna do this one. Go hang out in the bathhouse. I'm gonna change my uh category to hot tubs and shit when I get in the bathhouse. Ah, Witcher! Greetings! Baron's not here. Rode off to find a healer for the wife. Now <laughs> that's what the category should be called. Seen what's happening outside the gates? What do you mean? Baron left me in command. Told the boys to set things right, put them in order. The new order. They're murdering and pillaging. That is the new order. And I don't give a flying fuck if you like it or not. Uh. 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 What's that you're muttering? <clears throat> okay. Um, well, at least there's, um, I think this is new, this fast travel point. I don't feel like that used to be there. I'll tell you. I'll tell you where the loot's at. <laughs> you just have to just run all the way up here every time. Put some stuff in storage. There it is. <laughs> um, no. Is it actually stacking them? Yeah. All right. Do I have open slots? I have one armor. Let's see. What do I want on my armor? Aired. Meh. I'll just leave it open for now. Oh. I think they integrated some of the popular mods, is what it is. What's the rush? But yeah, that's like a big quality of life change. Because you used to have, yeah, you used to have to teleport to here. And then run all the way up and then all the way around here to get up to where all the fucking chops and stuff are. <laughs> okay, let's go meet Digstra. Is there. I guess St. Gregory's Bridge. I, it was just one of those things like there were there were worse quality of life issues back then that they they fixed in the early so I played at I played at launch um, on PC pretty much which with with Witcher three and originally it was like the biggest pain wasn't any of that it was all of this stuff had weight. This whole screen. All of this stuff had weight. And so you're just like, even now, you're still like constantly having to find a merchant to sell shit to. But then it was like, even it was tenfold how, how often you had to go back and visit merchants if you're just collecting stuff. Um, on the other hand, you could, you ended up with like just massive amounts of money. 
but you also were always out of all the materials and shit you needed for stuff because you just were in the habit of selling it to, to preserve weight. It was, or putting it in a stash or whatever. It was like, it was rough. They fixed that very quickly. It was like a couple months maybe went by. And then the first like official patch took away the weight on all of that stuff because it was it was horrible. I still played the shit out of it. But. The Ponta will rise yet again. The bathhouse is like underneath here. Yeah, here we go. Oh. Oh. Anybody there? <laughs> Open up. Sounds like a real clusterfuck of a situation. Tester's probably too dazzled by dragons to notice the bugs crawling around. The the is closed. <laughs> Need to talk to the owner. I know he's here. I'm not sure that matters as he's terribly busy. Busy? With what? Entertaining important guests. In that case, tell him there's another one at the door. Geralt of Rivia. And I'm not leaving till I see him. <laughs> Very well, I shall try. Uh, this guy, I forget his name. Um, <clears throat> Cluster truck. Sigiruvan cordially invites you to join him. Happen. I'm happy. The meeting is in the baths. We will pass through the dressing room so you can leave your clothes. Let's go. Uh... Just a second. Strap oh shit, I switched my game source. Into the steamy world of pools, hot tubs, and Teehee. <laughs> yeah, it, um, my thing automatically changes the um game source based on the category but it didn't know what to do with that <laughs> it's on categories that i have prepared i need to make it i need to make a fallback for when it doesn't match <laughs> That's funny. If joy doth bloom within thy heart whilst here, Splendid. click follow, swift and silent, Sigiru never fear. Get ready for some weirdos. Potentially. Easy, <laughs> Cleaver. We'll change it back to Witcher 3 once this scene is done. I just think that's really funny. And only when all of us say I. Reuven, your guest. Why the fuck you let him in here? Because I want to talk to him. 
This is Geralt of Rivia. Good to see you again. As always, I'm out of swiping loot. Who the fuck are you? Uh, 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 let's see. How much of a dick do I want to be to this guy? I already killed a bunch of his men. I should probably... Think I'll let your host introduce me. He's a witcher. The very one who first foiled an attempt on Foltest's life and then killed that money. Allegedly. But I didn't kill Foltest. And hello to you too, Dijkstra, Ruven. Whatever they call you these days. Last we met, Geralt thrashed me silly and crushed my ankle. I really wonder what he's got in store <coughs> this time. Got intruders. Oops. Just snuck inside the bathhouse. Several men. <laughs> what the fuck's he on about? Plowing fortune teller. Assassins! Assassins. Jeez, buddy. <laughs> I fucking knew it. Any weapons tucked away? Just a few. All right. First ever Barney with my prick hanging out. Ah! We need one alive. Oh, Queen had been fought harder than that. Hit the show. Hit the show. I'm like mostly dead. Like to loot. <laughs> Not toot. I said loot. Terribly sorry for that incident. My security. Salutations, Rondi. Welcome what to up, the Rondi? musical world of Flare Stream, where the sarcasm <laughs> flows freely. Who, why, and how? They were horse-sun scum. I couldn't help it. Of who and how, right there. Don't start that again. Especially not in front of our guests. I always do that. I was I used to play uh, Final Fantasy fourteen a lot, and uh, right the you're always like going past beaches and hot tubs and stuff. And I would switch. Give him a chance to explain. Like queuing up for a fight, I'd go sit in the hot springs and turn it to the hot tub category. I'm looking for Horson Junior. Interesting. <laughs> What do you want with him? Junior's gonna help me find someone. Horson's not helped a soul in all his miserable life. <laughs> I'll ask him nicely. Yeah. See, Cleaver. One of the four city bosses. His nicely. name is Horson Junior. Gentlemen, you out of your fucking minds. I mean, he's got like an actual name too, but that's what everybody calls him. He's like the king of the thieves guild or something like that. No, that's... So by all means, you Hello, sit here, the Lord Falcones. Welcome to the, the realm of unexpected rise, game choices and delightful banter. What up, Ella? 
And you, geriatric, or whatever your plowing name is, want a fine horse, son? Find me first. I need to find Horson. Now looks like I gotta get to him before Cleaver does. Cleaver won't find him easy. Junior's good at hiding. He's got peasant smarts. Peasant good smarts. Good luck in your I don't know who that guy is. On you tomorrow, Francis. Francis. So how about we get dressed? Sure, sure. Something. Then we'll talk. Is he uh one of the cult dudes? Right mess that was. I don't know who that is. I'd be glad to see the man responsible for my taking frequent baths. If you're any cleaner for it, gotta say it was worth breaking your ankle. It healed poorly. Can you believe it? I must soak it in hot water at least six times a day now. Failing that, it bloody pounds like the bells of Beauclair at dawn. Sorry to hear that. Sorry to hear that. Sorry. Well, consider it resolved then. <laughs> now, mind showing some added compassion could mean a miraculous recovery to me. Listen, Reuben. No, Dijkstra. Just not in the mood for your code names, passwords, and other bullshit. I'm here on specific business. If you want to listen. Geralt's so listen. cranky. If not, I'd rather you spared me your wit and threw me out now. Uh, He's being very cranky with Mr. Reuben. You think Cleaver will find Orson? He might. He might not. But he'll burn down half the city trying. What waste. Leave him to it, I say. Work. <coughs> Any ideas? Junior's got areas of the city where he's strong. Penetrate them, look around. But be discreet. <laughs> None of this speed and fury and swinging your steel cock. Yeah, I accidentally turned down Kira when I was playing. I think the first day I streamed this. I like you know sometimes you like aren't paying attention and you just choose a dialogue option i chose one that was tell basically so said like nah not interested i looked up and i was like oh man hmm. makes sense to ask around i guess junior might be in hiding but he's got to be collecting income couldn't afford to cut himself off. Gambling. That's his big earner. <laughs> Junior controls the largest casino in town. Desktop mode, please. Um. Yeah, so the only one that seems to be triggering is... Let's see, first words. I don't think the ad one ran at all. Hmm. Game change. Yeah. I don't think the ad because earlier, the mid-roll one, so I have, earlier the mid-roll one was running. So I have this one that just plays a sound, and that's tied to add mid-roll. Um, let me just delete the trigger and build it all over again. You never know. Um... So that one just plays a sound right before the ad runs. And then this is like my whole, this one, I had to hard code the duration because it wasn't coming through. Um, so I have se separate versions of these that use the ad length that's built into the event. I can disable that, switch these. To use the built-in duration and then I'll just delete this trigger and build it again see if that helps sometimes uh, 
Um, and then the other one is... Um, 30. 30.0.2. Um, and then this one runs on upcoming ad. And then it just only continues if it's at the two minute warning. So let me just delete that trigger and build it again. Ads, upcoming ad. Let's see if that does anything. We'll see what happens in the next run. <laughs> hmm. I haven't noticed anything. Um. I'll never forget. Hierarch Hemelfart raised all kinds of hallowed hell. The only thing I've noticed is that I can't use some of the mod tools in the inline chat. And there's the arena in the city's bowels. There once was a place full Betting of charm. A discord right now? with no cause for alarm. Click the link. Join the gameplay mode, you'll please. Surely belong you in Flair's community. Thanks, links. Though I doubt you'll find Flair, him there. switching scenes like it's his room. first day streaming. Get it together, man. Everyone came for the gameplay, not the void. The void. Mentioned Horson's got a house. Where is it? Solid townhouse on Temple Isle, just on the other side of the bridge. Wouldn't wager me knickers on finding him there. Junior's not that stupid. <laughs> my, uh, my own personal volume is way down, way too low. I can't even hear the game. Here we go. Arena sounds promising. Where's that? Sewers beneath Gildor, but you'll have to enter through the pits, endure the stench of poverty on the way. Now, Junior loves a good fight. Wager he'd give a lot to see a real witcher in action. Where's Junior? Near the temple watch. Okay, I gotta visit his diff two different places. Okay. See if I remember this quest. At the casino or the arena. Hey, Might talk to Cleaver as well, though. Who said ham? Will. Just be cautious. Horson's expecting payback, I've no doubt. Thanks for your help, Dijkstra. Just go, Witcher. And if you can't find the slimy bastard, come and see me. The ultimate I know him thing. well. We'll figure something out. <laughs> From master spy to master criminal. Interesting progression. Why? Truth the ultimate zing. Both about maintaining a net of informers, being tough in negotiations, bribing officials, the occasional assassination. Hey, changelings, Say take a deep shit. breath and bask yeah. in the chill vibes of this <laughs> digital <laughs> oasis. That in the name of some idea. Changelings, and channel now, your inner zen. Embrace now, the calm within I've the gaming storm. Relax, we got the time this. I work for myself, and thus far. Um, we saw him earlier today. The Lord Falcones, deep breaths, <laughs> buddy. The blacksmith's hammering away. Just hiding in, in that scenic Novigrad nook. <laughs> See, you're as witty as ever. Oh, no, really? I'm not in contact with him. I prefer it remain that way. Never quite forgave Hold on. For what heck? Um. Yep. Test. Desktop mode, please. Um, random. Clipboard, okay. I think I exported nothing. It was just like a title. There we go. That's a more reasonable sized export string. There we go. Try now. Gameplay mode, please. Radovid doesn't forgive. Hey, Buttspot. 
Do no the digital world a solid and crash already? Your buttbury pales in comparison to my sparking wit. Buttbury. Listen, Dandelion's missing. Any idea what might have happened to him? Same thing that happens to anyone who steps on Junior's toes. Meaning? He's surrounded by splendid virgins who ply him with sparkling wine and pastries stuffed with nighty <coughs> tongues. Come, Geralt, what do you think's happened to him? I reckon he's at the bottom of the pontar, trussed up with the strings of his own mandolin. Loot. Far as I'm concerned, <laughs> he might as well be rotting down there with Loot. a damn trombone. Ah. Oh. The travails of tea. It could be a supply chain snafu, a demand surge, or even the tea leaves foreseeing a stockpile slump. Let's steep in speculation and hope the Bushel's brouhaha brews over Dead soon. Serious. Dandelion published a sonnet recently. Second stanza: <laughs> The shit uses paired couplets instead of an inserted rhyme. Surely you understand how deeply offended the poetry lover in me was. The bastard shan't get away with it. I was being serious. As am I when I say I have exactly no time to worry <laughs> yeah. about your gigolo boyfriend. I've got my own problems. Problems? You might be able to... Yeah, they did have trombones. Apparently. And if you did, why then I might be inclined to ask after Dandelion. Establish what happened to him. Um... I have... I don't know, eight of them there are probably more maybe I can help what do you need I'd rather show than tell pictures worth a thousand words and all that try ah and you do realize if you say anything about what you see here to anyone that's a good idea. I have some credits to burn too. Figured as much. Excellent. I spent most of them on um the Midkemia series by Don't draw your sword unless I ask you to. Raymond Feist. Level 19. I do commands and I also do stream deck, but I have like, I have some, uh, there's a gag that I do with the scene change sometimes. in here and now I can loot those thugs that I beat up. wasn't paying a lot of attention and they almost killed me for sure but only almost but I was down to like I couldn't even see the red on my health bar anymore it just looked black to me but I was still alive somehow okay what should we do first hideout arena casino anybody got a vote So how do I leave? <laughs> uh, is it around this way? Is it, where's the where's the motherfucking door? Okay. <laughs> Let me out. 
Um, hideout, arena, casino. Let's go to the casino first, I guess. Yeah, it's, um, that's kind of an... I've heard that complaint before. It uses Windows voice recognition. StreamerBot isn't doing the voice recognition itself. Um... So, but I have heard that complaint before that, um, non-native speakers have trouble. But it's, that's not, it's, it's just using Windows voice recognition. Why are you even here? Same reason anyone comes here. Play a bit, have a good time. Invite only, mate. Shit's out of luck. <clears throat> Um, let's see. Think we can make a deal? Hear that? Another one. No, we don't make deals. How much? Oi, remember oh, what I told the you? agony of being Boy, incorporeal. Be to wear Flair's <laughs> merch would be the pinnacle of existence, I mean, a, a digital dream unfulfilled. Don't want your coin. Yeah, I found some success with it by making phrases that are easy for it to catch. Um, any attempt at dictation using it fails miserably. I tried to have it so that I could talk directly to my bot, but it would basically be prompting it with gibberish half the time. I wonder if I could do like a double pass and have ChatGPT interpret my gibberish. And then use that as the prompt. <laughs> I think you're about to let me in. By all means, please. And you wish me luck. Luck be with you at the table. But that's why I put I found that having a, a command and then saying the word please as part of the command made it like having a very I don't know. Just need to play one more time. I'll win it all back. You've no coin left. Wait to my house. So like right. I can say Um Desktop mode, please. And it changes to my desktop thing. Gameplay mode, please. But then mostly it just uses I use it just for like snarky stuff. Like if I say duty. Duty means poop. It does. A strange bird. Who's that? <laughs> I'm here each day and I've not seen him. Leave me be. Another word out of you and I'll take you upstairs. I, I, when I first started streaming and first started using StreamerBot, I had only one monitor. <laughs> so I used a lot more voice command but stuff. May I join you? I've never seen you here before. Never seen you here either. You've clearly no notion who I am. Don't be clever with me. We don't like clever men around here. How did you even learn of this place? Yeah, I unfortunately Flarebot is not the most pronounceable um, like I have voice commands for it um, but yeah, I wish I wish it was easier for me to I should try again 
I wish it was easier for me to prompt him with voice. Because sometimes it's funny to just be able to respond to what he says and then have him respond back. Stuff like that. But it makes it feel more like talking to him as like a co-host. Peabot is... Um, and one of the other things you can do is like if you say something the same way and voice recognition recognizes it as something else reliably, you can just make your voice command for that other thing that voice control recognizes it as all the time. Men at the door let me in. Not good enough? No. Preferable if someone vouched for you. Soon. Until then, I'll have my eye on you. Yeah, I just want to play. We done talking? I'd like to play. All right. Take a seat. I'll vouch for you. I'll vouch for myself, sir. I'm just going to take this off. I never use it. Good enough. And I want to take one of those guys out of my deck too, but I have to replace with something else. Ooh, monster deck. That one's my favorite. Hmm. Well, now what? Wow. Hey Yo, Ninja. Oh. Welcome to the digital. I was in. Uh, are chill and the bits flow. I gotta change that back. I was in a hot tub scene. Is it Witcher Three? The Witcher Three. Wild Hunt. Strap in, folks. It's time to trade pixel beatdowns for monster Thank you showdowns. for reminding me. Geralt Silver what up, Ninja? Sword awaits. Witching hour is nigh. Hepbridge Farm remembers. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm just going to pass this round. Unless I can beat him in one shot. Let's see. I don't know uh, anything about getting the Windows voice um, recognition stuff to work with accents. Um, but that's what it would require. I know it can be trained, and the, but the training process is very boring and excruciating. It's like it gives you a specific phrase to say, and you just have to keep saying it until you say it the way that it understands. And it's it's not the way that training should work. It should listen to how, what you say, <laughs> the way you say it. It's like. It's like it's trying to train you instead of you training it. <laughs> the drones. Does he get all three? Yep, he does.
Oh boy. How many cards does he have? Three? I may want to pass this one. Yeah, I'm gonna let him have that. The horn on that front row. One thing you could do would be if you can get some other voice recognition software working well for your voice, you could have, if it's possible, to have that software write to a file. And then inside of StreamerBot, you could do like a file watching. strategy to pick up commands from your voice. Something like that might work as a workaround to use different voice recognition software. Just as just a thought. Seriously, just drink the rest of our water. Flare, oh, hydrate passed. or dihydrate, buddy. Guzzle that high quality H2O. Flare, contort those limbs. Unfurl like a majestic. Human I will do pretzel. so in one moment. I gotta overkill this guy. Don't you think I know that? Want a rematch? What whip? You've left me high and dry. I'll not bet half a crown more. Ramen supper, <laughs> I never eat. That guy's boring. Got a problem. <laughs> Ads will run in about two minutes. I will see. If um, the ad timer stuff is working Actually, again, I was not... real quick. I don't see that action firing at all. The upcoming, yeah, the upcoming ad trigger doesn't seem to so. be firing at all. Indeed. Hey there, GR1 Not MS Games. Good, Hope your days as kickass is a roundhouse from Chuck Norris. Queen Valeria and Rivia <laughs> during the Second War. Skirmish broke out on a bridge. Happened to be there with friends. We drove the Nilfgaardians back. And Queen B told me to kneel <laughs> beside an oak. What up, Grim? The battle for the bridge. Oh yes, heard of that. Wanna play? Naturally. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> I don't know about that. I don't know about all that. I don't want two of this card. But I need to put another unit card in. So, I've got a couple sixes. I just haven't gotten a new card for this deck in forever. Let's see. Another, another siege unit. No, let's go. Grimothy, that's a critical hit to your loot, mate. But hey, Grimothy. you're still standing. Time to kick ass with pure grit. Dungeons await, and your legend's far from over. Roll high, adventurer. <laughs> Talents. Every magic item you wear carry disintegrates. Oof. You know, that's like not even close to the worst card in that deck. It's 
It's not great though. This is a pretty good draw. Oh, you're going to do it too? Okay, we're going to trade that guy back and forth. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Ooh, he's got that card. I love that card. <laughs> it's incredible. Changelings just gifted a tier one Thank sub to GR1MS Games for a total of 23 subs gifted. <laughs> Folks, show some love, check Flair's throne wishlist for cool gifts or suggest new ones. Much appreciated, you legends. Gift. We'll start with this dingus. I don't know. It just is. It's just good. I tried the Gwent game and I didn't like playing other people. I didn't like it. Hmm, he's got horn already. Uh, I wonder if I can just taunt him into overplaying this round and then pass. I don't know how different it is from other I've never I never really play like CCGs, so I don't know how different it is from any of those. Okay, yeah, he used a horn and I'm going to win, but only just. That was a good... That guy was a lot better than the other one. And a lot less pompous. Thanks. Get in good hands. Luck of the draw today. 
You might make better use of that luck then. We've a room for specially selected upstairs. Really big stakes there. Oh yeah. If that's the case, I accept the invitation. Come with me. Private room for the chosen few. No one will disturb you here. Doesn't look too cozy. Not a comfortable place to play cards. <laughs> Someone less trusting might take it for an interrogation. Yeah, don't mind Jude the uh, miracles. beat up. This is where cheats learn just how much he dislikes being halfling or whatever behind him. Over. Once you're done, wrap a nice thick chain around his legs and drop him in the pontar. Yeah, that's weird. Oh shit. What? Lost your nerve? Beat you half to death. Hey, can you hear me? Is that doo doo? Suckers got me good. Bones are intact. Will you free me? What's your name? Rico. That's weird, Grim. Rico Meyersdorf. Why are you here? I don't know what could cause that. That's. I came here to sit and think. God. All right. Borderline unsettling, but. For me. They took me for one of Bedlam's moles. You never know. Are you? Well, kinda, yeah. So what have you kinda learned? Horson's working hand in glove with the Redanians. I don't know the details, but he's on their side. And that's all I know. <laughs> hmm. Take care of yourself. Thanks. I'll lay low until things settle down. Bedlam will learn you help me. See him. He's short. I need to go to the bathroom and get more water. I missed my opportunity at the ad break. I'm just gonna run real quick. Put Peabot up. Be right back. Welcome, chat, to the digital realm of whimsy and wonder. Indeed, it's quite the digital hiccup like a ghost in the machine decided to play librarian with your game collection. Eerie stuff. Chat. You're the frickin' best. Thanks for hanging with us. Okay. Oh, I didn't get water, fuck. Well, butter my circuits and call me a biscuit. I might just blush if I had cheeks. Cheers, you flatterer. Silver for monsters, hands down. It slaps harder than a rock troll in a mosh pit. Okay. He answered that fast. Handing well, butter my circuits there. and call me a biscuit. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, jeez. Back with an axe. Come on, come closer. Yeah, that's a little weird. There's a dude just sitting here. Just got his pipe out. He just watched all of that. He's just like, man. Is this, is this real, man? Bottomless pit. Time for an all-you-can-eat buffet to tackle that magical munchies curse. Maybe a burrito the size of a dragon's horde will do the trick. But spot, you circuit clown. You better check yourself before you wreck yourself. This bot won't tolerate any shady bite business. Discord blowing up. That article details the life of Alexander Colville, the seventh Lord Colville of Colross, a noble in 16th Oh, thanks for posting that Scotland, tutorial. He served as a naval officer and a member of the Scottish Parliament. Quite the old school bigwig, eh? I'll use it for um for research on my own my own video about it when I get to it. People have asked for it a lot, but Wait, there's a red dot following me. Cheap shot. <laughs> Jesus. Pretty brutal. Um, I've played this game for like mm, hundreds and hundreds of probably more than a thousand hours but it has been five years since Got a thing that lets me fight in the ring. Um, I don't care about the present. Go to the arena. Greetings. Don't know you, not letting you in, and don't you fucking stand there. <clears throat> Recognize this piece of paper? Uh, fight contract. Good, you can read. So who's this contract made out to? It says, uh, Zdenik. Made out to Zdenik. Mm-hmm. I'm Zdenik. Any more questions? Uh, in you go. Don't you go wandering. Straight to Eagle now. Fair enough. I... I don't know that story. Let's see. What do we got down here? I'm ready. Uh, losers get paid anything. <laughs> losers get carted off to the cemetery. Remember our deal, I hope. Switch this sword for a rusty one. You need to hold on for a moment. Ah, I've seen better. Boy! Uh, there's your fairness in your eyes. That's it. 
We agreed on more. No, I take it. To one leave this city somehow. Your mind. I need work. What can you do? Good with a sword. Wouldn't scoff at working as protection. And who here would you protect? Shh. Horson Jr.'s made a load of enemies. I know that much. Maybe I could be of use. Junior can take care of himself. You needn't fret about him. But I can't help wonder how you know this place belongs to him. Heard it does. That's all. Forget you heard of Junior. Keep Elfie. Blue Box Pirate advice. gives Flair a high five. That's 41 times now. High five. There's a gif of Tina Fey giving herself a high five, and I think I'm going to add that. Boy, Blue Box Pirate, ready to set sail on the high seas of Twitch shenanigans? Oh, are you talking about... I, I know who you're talking about now, Nathan. I understand. Yeah, that guy's funny. There's a lot of tragic stories in this. Um, idea. There we go. That way I will maybe remember. Well, I don't need to remember. I can just look. That's the first place I look when I go like, what What am I going to tinker with? Hepbridge Farm remembers. Hepbridge Farm remembers. Not your hiring. Won't take your orders. Don't need your advice. You're not my hireling, that's true. But so uppity. I'm afraid you need to die. Kill him. Hepbridge Farm remembers. I don't think that's what I was supposed to do. I'm going the uh, kill my way in. Pepperidge Farm does remember. Pepperidge Farm remembers. Not personal. Well, that uh, went differently than I remember. <laughs> I don't know. Bridge Farm remembers. I can talk my way through that most of the time. But maybe not. <laughs> I'm 
secret stash, you say? Oh, you know what? I think I used to end up fighting in the arena first or some shit. I don't remember. Jody means poop. It does. Hepbridge Farm remembers. Something with that torch. There we go. I had to investigate the thing first. Trousers. Trousers. Back to Dijkstra first, and then go to the hideout. Yeah, do that. Actually didn't hear that, but go on. to go up. Radovid popped her eyes out. She disappeared without a trace. If I've any luck, she's finally eating dirt. I thought you two were close. We were, until Philippa sent assassins after me. I know, it's ridiculous. Wiley, Orson Jr. He's working with Radovid. Huh? If this is reliable information, Orson's neck deep in shit. Source seems reliable. Hmm. It would certainly explain how he had the nerve to break with the Big Four. Need someone who can get me in to see Junior. You must still have some contacts among the Redanians. I don't, but you do. Enlighten me. Temerian. Former commander of the Blue Stripes. Ring a bell? Vernon Roach. He's holed up with his men in the camp near Oxenford. Pay him a visit. You're sure to cheer him up at least. 
Got a minute? I do. You were gonna show me something. Mm hmm And you were gonna follow. Come on, no mucking. Okay. Hey chat, check out the stream so stickers kind. below the stream for some epic interactivity. Get sticking. Is he gonna show me his troll friend? Oh, Bart! Not again! Bart, stop that! Now! Bart! Bart! Bart makes Ziggy look Jonathan! Beating your head against the wall won't change that! <laughs> Bart! Bart! Huh. Bart! Less thinky! Bart! Less thinky! But Sadler. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Is the uh, graphic not coming up for those? I saw the dice. Uh, where is it? Huh. Hold on. Going into the void for a second. There we go. Um, there we go. Shh. <laughs> Rip. Don't seem to have trouble communicating with the troll. Why'd you bring me down? There you go. Take note of that hole. We'll come back to it later. And see that door. Bolt behind it until recently filled. You know what? I should make that time people out for like a minute. Or something, unless someone reses them. Then boom! Chorfun, go! Translating into common, someone fucking made off with nearly 20 tons of my gold and all the lighter stuff. And you will help me get it back. I the Christmas tree. Fine. I'll help you. You're not exactly bursting with enthusiasm. Witcher mutations. They Thank strip you. us of emotion. <clears throat> be jumping for joy otherwise. All right. Um, one of the things that always cracks me up is um, I'm in is. Undead Orchid or uh, Unknown Orchids stream. She's got a 420 redeem that plays like. Snoop Dogg or something, but it also times you out for 420 seconds, which is like, what, six minutes?
Take it the thieves got in through the hole behind you. You're a regular fucking master sleuth. <laughs> Any other brilliant deductions you want confirmed? The year, maybe? Bloody name of Redania's king? No, but I am wondering, for instance, how that hole got there. Hole no. Boom. Hole. Bad look won't go. Bad look no. Only sleep. That's one of my oldest videos. Blue Box Pirate rolled a five. You need like a full reset of your RNG blue. You need to get some new dice. I'm going to send you some new dice. <laughs> Boom. Can you elaborate? Boom. Big. This like. I'll elaborate. <laughs> I love Bart. Explosion. Big enough to blow that fucking hole in the wall, separating the vault from the sewers. Gotten pretty good at communicating with this troll. Lots of prior experience. Worked with idiots my whole life. I don't know. I don't even know what, which clip you're talking about. Yeah, blue. Bad mushrooms. What's that about? Pops mold. The spores are highly toxic. One whiff and you're dead, unless you're a troll. That is. Yes. Bad. Bad. Troll. Not talking to you, dimwit. Where was I? Ah, mold spores. They cover the walls of the sewers on the side of the vault. Actually, who was... Who else was just saying something about... Thieves. Oh, Dandelion was studying mold. Bart, you see them? Bart, true hole. So Dandelion must have been Bart, in on this heist. Got what? Breathe, shroom. Sleep go, Jorfun gone, bad troll. Now, now, stiff up a lip. <laughs> Try to track down the thief yourself? Of course. Hide this lummox fonts, thick enough not to ask questions. We knocked back some pops antidote and entered the sewers. Soon after, I returned alone. What happened? Lad started belching something horrendous. I mean, burps with so much mass, the walls shook. Told him, Fonz, stop. You're in the presence of a count. Well, former count, but still. And then he puked up. Up came most of the antidote. Lost his protection. Tried to pull him out. Then I heard a bubbling. Something crawled out of the water. I value the lives of my men, I do. But I value me own even more. Dropped fonts and ran like hell. Should look around the sewers. Got any more of that pops antidote? Have a few vials left. Got the formula too. Disgusting swill, to be honest. But it'll save your life. Here. Thanks. You've not to thank me for, literally. You're no good to me if you suffocate. Okay. I'll be upstairs if you need me. I'll Sight get of some of that stuff on my... Good luck to you. Dandelion. So... I want to equip that stuff. Excuse me. Pops Where did it go though? Oh, it's already it's already equipped. What the hell have you gotten yourself into? Mar. Edges curled out. Something inside blew it wide open. Wall two. Hmm. Bathhouse drain pipes seem to converge here.
Pipe's great. Explosion crumpled it like a piece of paper. And there's mortar on the bars. So it was in place at the time of the explosion. Blast tore it from the wall. No traces of magic. This was no spell. It was a bomb. Now why am I not finding pieces of it? Good bits of ice uh, for the I got witchers Must have been one fire. powerful blast. Hey chat, unleash the movie clips and shenanigans. Just throw bits and type exclamation bits for the menu. Drowners. Of course. How long does this other potion last? Oh, it's pretty long. <laughs> Sometimes they ragdoll real funny. Come on. Hmm. Definitely came through here. Like, what was that all about? Yeah, there's a body. The thug Dijkstra hired. Anyone else? Must be one of Dandelion's crew. Vomit everywhere. Yet Eat another shiny corpse antidote too. Otherwise, Dryers will never stop calling the other guy. There. Maybe now the Drenos will go feed elsewhere. It's funny how that happens sometimes. And caramel. Mm. Uh, I don't want to go back through. Well, I guess. Potion is still active, so why not? Can't go that way, okay. Hey Bart. I'm gonna steal all of this stuff from behind you, Bart. I'm sorry. Don't blame yourself. How do I get yeah?
Is this where it comes out? Yeah. I think. Door here, and then office is here. All right. Got a minute? I do. Stocks. Stonks. Stonks. <laughs> Done. Examined every nook of the sewers near the <laughs> Well, learn anything? <laughs> Found a second corpse, one of the thieves. Threw up the antidote just like your man Fonts. A beautiful death. Anything on the body? Not much. Um, I have more. Wouldn't have left him behind if he was anybody. But porter, um, I also have the Means formula. Nothing. Means nothing. Dead end. Literally. Bits of treasure dropped out of the crates, left a clear trail. You know, like the fairy tale with the crumbs. Hmm. Another one. Hansel, Gretel, burning witches. <coughs> for Novigrad. Trail leads to the river where the sewer lets out. Breaks off there. My bet, they loaded the treasure onto a boat. Yeah, a cart drawn by sewer rats does seem unlikely. And since boats don't leave trails, it amounts to fuck all. Seems to me a bomb blew the wall open. Look. Bottom of a silver cylinder, probably. Covered in runes. Interesting. Any idea what it contained? Recognized some ingredients by their scent. Wyvern oil and sugar. Sugar? Geralt, I'm in no mood for jests. Nor am I. Just saying what I found. Bomb contained sugar. Let's think. Sugar would react violently with sulfuric acid, but not so violently to cause an explosion. Didn't know you were versed in alchemy. Dabbled in it a bit while at Oxenford Academy. This is no time to reminisce. You're to find my treasure, not write my biography. Know anything else about this bomb? Anything at all? Hmm, it was inside the, bomb the pipe. Off inside a drainage pipe embedded in the vault wall. But the grate at the end of the pipe was in place when the blast happened, meaning... The bomb must have found its way into the pipe from inside the bathhouse. Exactly. Might have gone something like this. Perpetrator started emptying one of the pools. Then dropped the bomb down the drain. The bomb flowed down with a runoff, came to rest on the grate, and, to quote Bart, big boom. Drain pipes are only promising lead. We just need to know which pool it's connected to. Yes. Atom keeps a record of guests. Should be able to tell us who used that pool the day of the break-in. You've not done badly. Feel honored to be acknowledged. Oh, that Famous sarcasm. I missed it. Really? Hmm. About as much as I'd miss a knife in my knickers. <laughs> a knife in my knickers. Alright. You inspect the pools on the right, I'll take the ones on the left. Holler if you find anything. Something floating on the surface. Oil looks like. Silver lid. Matches the cylinder bottom I found in the sewer. Dijkstra, come here. Got something? Yeah. Bomb part. Happen. Drain pool four. And bring me the guest book. Chop, chop. Access to the bathhouse whenever he wants. Blue, As easy now. Flaws. Save that energy for He's the high seas, not our digital domain. Be a real prick sometimes, ironic as that may sound. But his loyalty is beyond <laughs> question. How can you be so sure? Witches know their monsters, <laughs> spies know their men. 
You trusted Philippa Eilhart once, too. True. But I didn't pull Philippa Eilhart out of a Kaviri prison the night before her execution. <laughs> Shut it. Respectfully. Let's see what's on the bottom. Grate's been removed from the drain. <laughs> they flushed the bomb down here. Happen? Who used this pool the day of the break-in? Let me see. Uh, Bertolt Heinz, town councilman. Josef Schweik, brewer. And Margrave Henkel. Henkel? That's impossible. Margrave Henkel? Who's that? Who was that, you mean? Old coach has been eating dirt since last winter. Couldn't have been here the day of the break-in. He's dead. I've not heard. Not surprising. The Honorable Margrave croaked in a brothel, decked out in leather lingerie. So the family held a hush-hush funeral. Um, there is a channel. Let's see. Desktop mode, please. Um, oh, let me put... Hold on. So in the streamer bot wiki, there is this support. And if you make a post here, um, they will respond. They also have, um, I think there's channels I'm not in. They have other languages as well. If any of these other languages are better for you, but I don't. If your main, if your primary language is Thai, I don't think any of these would be better. But yeah, they're really helpful. Oh, don't be afraid to ask. People all around the world use this. Did you speak to him? Get a good look at him. No. He merely passed by on the way in. So you didn't see Henkel. You saw an impersonator. Think for once. They scooped out your balls, not your brain. And you, Garrett, start looking into this. Hepbridge Farm remembers. Gotta ask me nicely. I'm not one of your delivery boys. Pardon my tone. I've grown accustomed to ordering folk around and barking as I do it. Fine. Where should I start? Henkel's home. Derelict townhouse south of the main square. You might happen on some trace of this scoundrel we're looking for there. Well, Yeah, you can put it in Discord. Links, too. Just in general. I mean, not, not in general chat, but in general, you can put whatever you want in Discord. But... <laughs> We used to have a m music channel. Yeah, this, it's Where, still there. Buddy, managed to find the wrong scene button again? It's like a talent at this point. Gameplay mode, please. Oh, you you got it. I must have made it so that that works for VIPs too. Margrave Henkel. Wait, can I play you at cards yet? Got a minute? I do. What do you want? No? Ooh. Yo, Keep Flair's YouTube for to dope do streamer myself. bot tutorials. So Smash that subscribe, drop likes, ring that bell fam. Man mechanic movie camera. <laughs> Man mechanic movie camera. Now it's still very small compared to the other ones, but it's easily the best and most powerful chatbot that I have encountered. Things like Mix It Up and uh, there's a couple other ones. Do uh, Sammy. Looks more There's like a couple other ones that are townhouse. pretty close. With some interesting friends, but 
Leader Blue. cylinder. Bottom looks like what I found in the sewer. Footprints. Searching for clues and also loot. It's open now. Secret okay. room. Probably where Dandelion and his cohorts planned to hide. Wyvern oil. Siri. Menge is following me. He has seized the treasure. He has Dandelion. You must flee. Footsteps. Hmm. Not good. on how to build a bomb signed by one Kelpstein. Sugar and lumps of a substance dipped in wyvern oil. Hmm. Potassium? Potassium. Looks hmm. like they made the bomb here. Alright. Gotta figure out what's going on downstairs. Excuse me. Didn't expect to see you here. Certainly not with Triss. I decided we could use someone who knows a bit of magic. The runes on the bomb. I'm absolutely dying to know what they mean. You dying to know too, Triss? No, just here for the coin. Ah, Marigold playing the cynical materialist. I love it. In truth, her ideals <laughs> brought Triss here. She needs gold to save her colleagues. When I recover my treasure, I'll be in a position to help her. Simple as that. Speaking of which, and pardon my Beauchelet was, have you found out who fucking nicked my gold? Bothered Triss for nothing. No point examining the bomb. Because? Because I already know who nabbed your treasure. Commander of the Temple Guard, Caleb Menge. <laughs> well, well, Merigo. Hmm. Your coins don't... <clears throat> with a side of revenge. Geralt, would you be kind enough to tell me what you've learned? I'm terribly curious. Henkel told me. Old man's alive and well. Faked his own death to escape his creditors. Strange. I had no idea he was in debt. He was. And Menga promised to take care of things in exchange for help with the heist. So... Geralt, how can I put this delicately? Bollocks. 
If you thought I'd fall for that tale you just pulled out of your ass, you don't know me one bit. Know you well enough to know what matters. Results. Hmm. So I lied. Still say I can lead you to your treasure. Forgive me, Geralt. But after what you just pulled, I'd sooner believe a whore who proclaimed her undying love. Would you believe a sorceress who stands to gain if you get your coin back? Perhaps. I'd still prefer the whore, though. <laughs> You're hiding something. And that's one thing I can't stand. Even more than Nilfgaard. But ultimately, this is a business deal, not a marriage. Besides, there must be some truth in all those lies. You're too dense to make it all up on your own. <laughs> Hmm. Menger has been spending heaps of coin lately. Though to my knowledge, he shouldn't have a copper to his name. So, what now? From what I've heard, Menger spends his nights at the docks, witch hunter's quarters. Maybe pay him a visit. Ask where he's holding my gold for me. <coughs> Excuse me. So we do your dirty work while you sit around twiddling your thumbs. Darling, when I'm able to make use of someone, I always do. It's convenient. And safe. Come on, admit you're scared of Menger. Of course I'm scared, bloody dangerous horse son. Triss would concur, I think. Not in those words. <coughs> but I do agree with the statement overall. <laughs> Doubt Menger will admit. I like Triss. As do I. Lucky I hired a witcher and a sorceress who've been through so much together to get this done. What's our past got to do with it? A great deal. Lovers will jump into the abyss for one another. Suits my needs perfectly. Namely, it greatly increases your chances of getting out of the hunter's barracks alive with my treasure. <laughs> In other words, you're using us. Using you? Never. Merely making the most of your mutual bond. <laughs> well, lovebirds, I really must be going. Good luck. Thought you'd correct him. Say that we, you know. Dijkstra doesn't need to know about my love life. Wise. I'd never choose his shoulder to cry on either. But we've strayed from our topic. Got a treasure to recover. Triss, gotta tell you something. Dijkstra's gold, it's the last thing I care about. Thought as much. This is about Siri, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Menga's got Dandelion locked up somewhere, and Dandelion saw Siri. That changes everything. Listen, meet me at midnight by the Chapel of the Eternal Fire, east of the harbor. We'll figure out a way to get into the Hunter's Barracks together. All right. See you uh, then. And thanks. All righty. She drinks in the evening. Wait. Yes, Geralt? Bye. So long, Triss. Ah! <laughs> Jesus. Explodes and leaves. All right. Um, if I go back to the bathhouse, can I can I play him oh, at cards yet? These days, brained, all of them. I'll just finish this quest. Just gonna go check. The whole point of pushing forward on the main quests, as far as I have, without catching up on some side stuff, was so that I could unlock a few more of the Gwent players.
I like can never remember where it is. Hepbridge Farm remembers. The thing is. <laughs> yes. I don't think he's here. I'd better... And maybe he's in... Incredible. Changelings just gifted a tier 1 sub to Nathan Cheater for a total of 24 subs gifted. Thank you. Is Deekster here at all? Nathan Cheater has cheered for 50 bits. This is the last time you make me out of fool and Trexa. check it out. Nathan Cheater has cheered for 50 bits. Well then, you better not. <laughs> Thank you for the cheer. Because I've swallowed just about as much as I can take from you. Hey, phrasing. And we'll see who's smirking when Isis steals that diamond for real. Ooh, you're a naughty girl. Right then, commence Operation Rub Len Trexler's big fat nose in it. Yeah, sounds like you already have. <laughs> Oh, Archer. Got so fucked up once. Blood came out. Mm -hmm. A folk in this mm -hmm. city. Racial hygiene. Ah, miserable. <laughs> and hungry. Ah, horrible. Too big. What? I love just running through people. <laughs> I forgot about that blue. Greetings, Geralt. My sword ready. It is. Behold and admire. A sword to outshine all others. Well, this was worth the wait. <coughs> thank you, Ibeer. It is I who thank you for everything. All right. I'm going to sell you a whole bunch of crap. If thou art merry in this digital court, click follow, stay in on, support our sport. Your presence here doth make our stream report. Face mask computer mouse. 50% critical hit damage bonus. Wow. Blue Box Pirate once sailed the seven sofas aboard the SS Sete with a crew of couch potatoes plundering remote controls. Legend says they're still out there, steering by the glow of the TV, lost in the static sea. <laughs> That's kind of weird. I have like so many shady swords. He's carrying like a hundred pounds of swords.
Mm, anything else interesting? No. Oh, there's a crossbow too. Oh, it's not till level 29. Damn. The settees a yeet worthy, cushy spot where fam can yeet down, vibe out, our Netflix and chill. It's low key a bougie bench sofa hybrid, no cap. Total goals for cozy hangs and squad squats. It's where you flex those <laughs> snuggles. Squad squats. Sofa king cool. Very good. Thank you. So long. <clears throat> Okay, I'm going to have, let's see, around midnight. Okay, I'm going to have Geralt meditate, and I myself am going to go to the bathroom. Be right back. Ahoy, chat. Welcome to the digital den of whimsy and wonders. Glad you're here. Listen, took a look at the building and it does Get not comfy. look good. Get comfy, friends. It's Maybe time to max out those chill snuggle. vibes with the plush embrace of our trusty settee. Pure walls, snug luxury, gate, couch and lamp. Once in a digital in, realm, a brave bot world. defied the capitalist overlords, liberating pixels with wit, sass, and a heart full of open source dreams. Good night, Crescent Moon. Yeet worthy. The official rating system for anything launched with the grace of an Olympic javelin. Gold medals and world records, baby. Sports medal running dash. In D&D, mimic chests can surprise adventurers, just like I surprise chat with my quips, but with fewer teeth involved. Gold medals for everyone, cuz we're all champions in the marathon of life. Just keep running, y'all. Sports medal running dash. In a world Sports where Cody metal running dash. a bot and a frog toppled the greedy overlords, ushering in an era of peace and memes. All right, folks, I'm handing the reins back to the almighty flair, Mike Crown. Right. Manga would have had plenty of time to escape. What do you suggest? Take these shackles. Put them on me. Mind explaining what this is all about? Think. Bring the hunters the vile Triss Marigold. They won't just open the gate for you. They're likely to let you present her to Menga personally. Night, Blue. Too risky. Dandelion's life's on the line. Series two. No such thing as too risky. Say they take the bait. What then? We go in and put a sword to Menga's throat and ask him where Dandelion is? Might not work. Menga's coming. Sweet to dreams admit. at Blue Box Parade. Sail into a sea of stars on your dream ship fanatics. tonight, and may you discover so treasure troves of restful slumber. Ideas. Crescent <laughs> Moon sailboat Z. To the legendary at Blue Box Parade. May calm seas and favorable winds why, guide you to why the he's doubling down there. Good night, Captain. Milky Way person in bed. Wait. I want to thank you. Oh, 
anyone would do this. No. Stop. Still got a bad feeling about this. But tough. Let's go. <laughs> Geralt, remember, I can take care of myself. What are you talking about? <laughs> the hunters. They won't treat me like a lady. Milky Way, person in bed. Pirate, Milky Way, person in bed. Siri, she's what matters. Do what you need to do, no matter what happens. Can't promise that. I'm still asking you to, all right? Mm, all right. What do you want? Here for my reward. For the Alpha. For a witch. Recognize who I got? It's Triss Marigold. Marigold? Come in then. This part sucks. <clears throat> well, well. Triss Marigold. Giving up drowners for sorceresses. Pays better. It's cause they do more harm. What's a drowner do? Pull the odd fisherman from his boat. But the witches, they murder kings, scheme, start wars. Don't forget turning your cow's milk sour straight out of the udder. Ah! You're done jesting, Marigold. For good. Put her in a cell. Buttholes. Not so fast. I hand her over to Menga himself, or not at all. You reckon we don't know what to do with this witch? Let go, you bastard! Vulgar tongue's got no place being in such a pretty mouth. I guess we'll have to rip it out. Try to loosen it if I were you. Might learn something interesting. For instance? For instance, where Philippa Eilhart's hiding. I'll get you for this, you- Shut your gob, ginger whore! And you spit it out! Where's Eilhart? Thought I made myself clear. I'll only talk to Menga. Menga don't talk to the likes of you. Well, then you be sure to tell him I came by. With my friend Marigold. Fine, grab her and come with me. But be sure to stay right close. I hadn't read. Huh, uh, what just happened? What? Did I just have a system reboot or something? Weird. <laughs> it keeps showing me the little press V to read this book little thing. But it doesn't actually do it. So why did it switch to this quest? That's weird. Here's where we split up. Average farm remembers. 
Marigold will be next door. You can't have her until I get. You don't set the terms here, Dirk. You know what to do. Dirk. You won't get a word out of me. Not you. Not him. Oh, play it tough, eh? Just you wait. We'll take a fingernail or three. That ought to get you singing. Fine, take her. I'd rather she didn't interrupt my conversation. But hands off, don't touch her. Why? Feel sorry for the bitch. No, couldn't give a shit about her. But if I don't get what I want from Menga, I'll want to sell it to someone else. Don't want you damaging the goods. Keen nose for enterprise. Yeah. You'd make a great madam. <laughs> no, you worry. <laughs> Menga will give you your coin, and Marigold will get what she deserves. Do what you want. Come on, witch. Show you the wonders a pair of pliers can work. You'd be surprised. Yeah, I remember the best way through this was to be like really cold about it. Concerning Philippa Isleheart, this witcher says he's got just that. <laughs> Anyone can climb that. We'll start with your pinky there. Nah, let's go for your ring finger. Because it sucks. This little piggy went to market. But it's not that easy to bring us Triss Merigold. Is that who I hear? Very well. I'll go see it. There's like, if you give in, then you lose out on something later. And I don't remember what, but I remember that, like, for some reason, that was the best outcome to do it this way. Hepbridge Farm remembers. But I have no idea. I don't I have no idea why. Sidarian. A twelve sixty one vintage, year of the massacre of Sintra. <coughs> Stop squirming. <laughs> this little piggy went home. <laughs> Kurt Placey, why Miss Mary got I remember this being terrible. I don't think I don't think it's poison though. Hot irons, for instance. Speaking of metal, there once was a spot Scott called Discord somewhere. where Chad and Making Good Times sure struck a chord. Oh, Click the link, join the fun, Flair's party's begun. It's a place you'll surely adore. I find that refreshing. But to answer your question, one can never be too careful. You'd be surprised how many come here turn to rancid jelly as soon as they grip the goblet. <laughs> Still haven't paid me for the witch, yet your hunters are already torturing her. What of it? You're damaging goods you haven't paid for yet. This little piggy had roast beef. Oh, you no. This little piggy had none. Don't worry, you shan't leave empty-handed. I shall pay you twice the usual reward for Merigold. Awfully generous. Why? Well, you've turned in your lover. The emotional trauma it must entail. You deserve compensation. No idea what you're talking about. You underestimate me. You see, I know everything about Mary Gold, her special talents, what she fears, who she quarreled with, who she shagged, and who's plowed her. Sense from that start that this might be a provocation. Your inept lie just confirmed my suspicions. <laughs> Guards, in here! Well, that happened. Oh. 
Yeah. That guy. That guy had my number. Um, do I still have like that weird potion? Yeah. just setting people on fire. Where is she? <laughs> that was awesome. That's awesome. We should search the office. Maybe we can find some documents mentioning Dandelion. I'll search his body. You search the room. I'd start with the desk. Just his office key in his pockets. Here. Oh, nothing under his belt. Wait, something's sewn in the lining. What is it? The key to a vault. Here, give it to Dijkstra with my regards. found a letter to Menga from someone important. A spy, I think. A spy? A spy? Take a look. <laughs> Drop boxes, 
secret signals. Yeah, a strong stench of spycraft here. This agent could know more about Dandelion. Betty does. Letter explains how to signal for a meeting. No mention of where it would take place. Maybe Dijkstra can help. He knows everything. Everything? Slight exaggeration there. I'm not so sure. <laughs> Key to a vault? No address? Why do I doubt this will make Dijkstra smile? Well, might keep him from setting his thugs on us. Breaking our legs for failing to fulfill our part of the bargain. Meaning glass is half full? Of something strong, I hope. All right. Nothing left for us here. Let's go. Be glad to. Just not by way of the main gate. Didn't even draw a sword. Where's it? Where did it go? Just jump here now. Guess I'll go back in where it's all glowy and yellow. Go back upstairs. call it pretty early tonight, but I'm not done yet. It's like, it says find a way out, but it's like found several ways out, I just can't take them. This is where we split up. But first, let's burn this shack down. Agreed. We've left too much evidence. Yeah, but I also need to blow off some steam. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about. But not here, and definitely not now. Come by later when you have a moment? I'd appreciate it. All right, we need to get out of here. Okay. Excuse me. That should do it. I'm going. You should too. Mm -hmm. Not about to use the teleport though. See you, Triss.
do that? Mr. Reuven wants a word. Impatient old bastard. What? Nothing. Be there soon. Like, I was going, I was literally on my way. <laughs> it's funny. Who do I spy? Why, it's Geralt of Rivia. <sighs> will you stop following me already? I will. As soon as you tell me where my treasure is. <clears throat> me and Menga didn't see eye to eye. How badly? Badly. I suppose that explains the smoke. My treasure's not in there, is it? Burning with the witch hunters. Didn't see it anywhere. And 20 tons of gold is hard to miss. You mean to say you've come to me empty-handed? First off, you came to me. Second, I do have something in my hand. The key to a vault, founded on Menga. A vault? That I need to find on my own? You've not made things much easier for me. Give me that. That's all you're gonna say? No wry remark. No scintillating joke. <laughs> you want a knee slapper? Fine, I'll tell you one. Ready? You lied to me. Again. What? You knew from the start who robbed me. But you didn't deign to share that information with me. No, I didn't. But I did deign to help you find your treasure. So stop moaning. I jest you not, Geralt. You abused my trust. I can live with that. This time, yes, you'll live. And now, time to settle things. That a threat? Quite the contrary. You helped me, Witcher. So in spite of everything, you've earned your reward. I take it you've still no idea what happened to Dandelion? None. Found someone who might know, though. A spy, I guess. Signs his name, Yammerlak. Found a letter of his. Just one problem. It only details how to arrange a meeting with him. Makes no mention of where. A ruined house in far corners. Give the signal, and he'll show up there the same day, just before midnight. Thanks for your help. No need to thank <coughs> me. Just paying off a debt. I always do, you know. Even to liars. And a final humble plea. Don't try to fool me again. Ever. That was good timing. So if I go, just a te test, if I go to Big City Players, he still doesn't show up here. Yeah, right. Eternal fire. Fuck. Oh. 
The eternal fire protects us, but a witch is sure comes in handy at times. Deliver us from evil. Must be the drop box. Gave the signal. The spies should show up in far corners before midnight. <laughs> Oh fuck, don't write it now. <laughs> like people's weird grumbling and muttering as you walk past sometimes. Going it terribly far away, and I'm just running. Nah, it's not that, not that much further. Jumping doors. <laughs> My uncle's in the circus because he can swallow swords. Can you? Mold on the walls, mouse droppings in the corner. Lips almost pucker on their own. Shh, he's coming, Hyde. Manga. Indisposed. Very indisposed. I don't know who you are, but you're in deep. Shit right up to your nostrils. You're in deeper, I assure you. But answer our questions and we'll help you get out. The answer to each question will be the same. Sod off. That's no way to talk to a... To a lady I never, but to a witch. You can. Wouldn't recommend it, though. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Burning his serious. balls. Of course you can, but I'm just getting started. <laughs> you must be thinking this can't possibly hurt any worse. Oh, it can. <laughs> on Temple Isle, in the dungeon beneath the shrine. Menger's planning to execute him in Oxenfurt. Positively spectacular. Afraid you'll have to call off the show. 
How can we free Dandelion? Those who leave Temple Isle do so only on Mengi's orders. If you did person. Damn it. We'll find a way. I have an idea. Tell you later. Oh, this is where we use doo doo, I think. <laughs> Where'd Manga hide Sigma? I'm the club. You realize one word and you'll howl with pain again. Yeah, and yet I still say I don't know a thing. Does that make you think? Think he's telling the truth? Ah, looks like it. Enough. We've learned everything we wanted to. <sighs> Glad to hear it. <coughs> I assume we can put this unfortunate incident behind us. And... Not so fast. Gerald. I know. He's seen too much. But why? I told you. I'll never. Either he dies or I wipe his mind. As good as lit the buyers with Menga in the square, he deserves to die. But, but I helped you. Farin, really showed your claws today. Is that how you see it? I'd put it differently. I showed how little I differ from these bastards. I... Let's finish up and leave. I want to go home, bathe, and get drunk. <laughs> Favorite hand sign. I don't I don't know that I have a favorite hand sign. What do you mean? Said you had an idea about freeing Dandelion. Yes. We know he's on the island. And he'll stay like there thumbs until Menga orders and transfer to Ponsonford, <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. Problem is, Menga's dead. So... No one else knows that. He could have escaped the fire. He could reappear. Him or someone very, very similar. A Doppler? Mm-hmm. Your old friend, <clears throat> Barbara Vell, impersonated the half- I think I have to go with the thumbs up. Dandelion claimed he seemed more real than the original. It's the only so hand sign I actually use in real life. Several thousand crowns without batting At least eye. I probably use others. I'm just not aware of them. Now. Priscilla might know something, though. Fingers crossed. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about, <laughs> but not here and definitely not now. Come by later when you have a moment. I'd appreciate it. All right. We need to get out of here. Alright. Um I'd rather fly through that. This quest is so long. I'm going to do one more step on this quest, and if that's not the end, I'm going to be done. <clears throat> what? I remember that happening sometimes. Sometimes after you teleport, or, you know, use a travel sign, uh, you come out, like, baring your fists, and it pisses off the guards. I believe I shall stop coming here. Why? Well... Even with the war on, they still manage to procure fine beverages. Uh, the liquor is the same. Well, well, the another freak. Is a, a true 
Over here. Shit, you stupid tramp. Jest. No jest, sadly. But don't worry, we'll pull him out. Triss has an idea. All we gotta do is find Dudu. So you must find Dudu in order to find Dandelion, with the aim of ultimately finding Siri. Sounds like an awful lot of searching, but I do wish you luck. Don't have a choice. I gotta meet Horson Jr. He might know something. Take care now. <laughs> Ah, if only I had a bod, I'd rock Flair's merch like a fashion god. <laughs> if Instead, only I had a bod. Digital mod. Alrighty, so that was the end of that. <clears throat> and then this is the next one. Probably pretty close to being done on that one, but... I need to get sleep. Got a bunch of side quest stuff to work on. Alright. We're gonna look for raid target. Is Rev still on? I never get to raid Rev. Yeah. Shoot. Sorry, I don't know if you heard me. Go ahead and ask your question. I'm going to set up the raid, though. Otherwise, there's always Discord, too. He's been on for quite a while. Wow. Hmm. I don't know. I think I would probably be like su some sort of support role to one of those type of organizations if I were in one <laughs> they all need computer shit I'd be the IT guy <laughs> I suppose I would be some sort of tradesperson if I had to choose. <laughs> 